Hello. Welcome to my world. <laughs> I want to give you an update on the seeds, the seeds that I planted in the fall. Here we go. There's one. It's doing really well. Some kind of a cucurbit. I have it inside this little, this little uh, piece of wire here, and it's doing really well. Here I have another one that's doing almost the same, and it doesn't have a little fence around it, which is good, because I think that means that the bunny rabbits are not eating it. Look how cute this is. These are all weeds, but it's so cute how they're growing in rows because I had some old fencing material here, some kind of plastic fencing that I laid down here. And this stuff with the little tiny yellow flowers, this is pineapple weed. And it is so, it's growing really, really a lot this year. Look here, I have a yellow flower on my cactus. Here's a different view of my base camp. This area here with the uh, AstroTurf is where I used to do agility training with my dogs. I can hear my dogs barking up there too. The oleanders are looking really nice. I think it's interesting how this one here has a little white line down the middle of its petals. Most of them are just a solid color. A good desert plant. So why do you think that the year 2020 is the year of victory? How is it a victory to you? I was watching a lady the other day on YouTube and she was talking about the miracles that have happened in her life since the beginning of the quarantine. And I got thinking about it. I wrote down all the wonderful things that have happened ever since that day. You might try it. You'll be amazed. Well, Jesus said, that we will have trouble on the earth. There are troubles. There will be troubles. But he said, be very, very glad when you encounter various trials. Because the testing of your faith brings patience. He also said that, yeah, you'll have troubles. But be very, very happy. Because he's overcome. He's overcome all the troubles. You might not see it yet. But you keep on going. You'll see it. That's why the year 2020 is the year of victory. Because every year is the year of victory. When you serve Jesus, when you love Jesus, when you realize who he is and what he did, then you realize every year that you have on earth is the year of victory. So 2020 is the year of victory. No matter what's happening all around, no matter what's happening in the world, be of good cheer. He says, you will have troubles, but out of them all, he will deliver you. He didn't say some of them. He didn't say he'd deliver you if you're good enough or if you're nice or if you did everything right. Because he knows that we don't always do everything right. We might try, do our best. But he said out of them all, he'll deliver you. Every trouble, every trial, every single thing. And you know what? If God said he will deliver you out of every problem, he will. Because his word is an eternal covenant. It's an eternal contract. It's an eternal promise. And God cannot lie. It will never change. 
His word will never change. And if he said he's going to deliver you out of every problem, you can be assured, absolutely assured, that he will. So I'll see you next time. Adios. Mwah. Remember, Jesus loves you. And I'll, I'll be sure and subscribe and like and comment and ring the bell. And I'll see you again. Bye.